the dating of the paintings in the caves. They're from right back to thousands and thousands of years ago until 200 years ago. And in history, that means that Aboriginal people lasted from there to there and no further, and yet we're still here. My two sons, Katie. Yeah. Hi, Katie. Katie. Well, I believe everybody has their culture. Unfortunately, ours was taken away a long time ago. This is how the Ngarangiri done, done their bark canoes, Bondik, they done their bark canoes the same way. Because it's about, you know, getting um, this type of cultural knowledge passed along to our future generations. And uh, today what we're, gonna do, what we're gonna use, we're gonna use a cherry picker. I never ever thought I'd be doing something that's gone down in history. I never thought that. It's about strengthening people to look at their culture, to look at who they are, to strengthen them. It's about healing the spirit within all of us that live in this country today. Yeah. Where we're standing now would have had water in yeah. it right yeah. now. Learn about us. This is who we are. Learn about our, our stories. Learn about the stories of the land that you live on. How this land was created. This why was these trees put here? And you can see that those trees were put here for a reason. They were put here for making bark canoes.